Hey, what's up, everybody? This is Osterk51, and today I want to show you guys a new legendary farm glitch. And this is absolutely the best legendary farm I've seen in Borderlands 3 since the release of the game. And you're going to need to be on Amara to do it the way I do it. So what you're going to do, you're just going to need the phase grasp ability. Any of them on Amara should work perfectly fine. Now, what you're going to do, you're going to be offline, and then you're going to go to Jacob's Estate, and you're going to be going to the place that pretty much everybody knows about which is the loot tink farm you'll see it in the video basically what you're going to do once you get to the bridge that you'll see in the video um you pretty much want to just go on the bridge up to the point where enemies start spawning you're going to want to clear them out and then you'll see this on the video as well so it'll make more sense when you watch it then when you go more when you go forward more then the loot tink will spawn now you want to be offline so it's a guaranteed spawn um but once this loot tink spawns basically what you do is you just follow it around until it stops now when loot tinks stop they basically start creating a portal with their feet that they'll jump into but if you melee them or shoot their backpack it will interrupt them cancel the portal and basically make them fall over a little bit and once you do that, right when you make them stop the portal, you phase grasp at their feet. And what this is going to do is it's basically going to pull them halfway into the ground and have half their body still showing. And they will just be stuck there. And not only will they, every about every second, they will just spew out money in front of them like every second. You can just shoot their backpack as much as you want as long as they have shields and it'll just be spewing out legendaries, other items, ammo. It'll spew out pretty much everything besides like iridium out of the backpack. Now, make sure you do not crit the loot tank when they're stuck in the ground. If you crit them, for whatever reason, they will become unstuck because I think they do like some type of stumble animation so they will pop out if you crit them so only shoot their backpack don't shoot them in the face and you can just sit here as long as you don't kill them you can just sit here and shoot them as much as you want now make sure they have shields because they won't drop anything from shooting their backpack if they don't have shields and you can just let them regen they will regen shields an unlimited amount if you don't damage them for a certain amount of time now if you can get a lower level weapon that'll obviously be better because you can shoot them more doing more damage to their backpack won't make more items spawn and i have a level one infinity pistol in this which took me a ridiculously long amount of time to farm i know there's some um ways to kind of glitch multiplayer or like co-op games to be able to get legend lower level legendaries quicker basically how i did this was i just increased my legendary drops with a trainer on pc and then farm chests at level one areas that's literally how i got this it took a long time but if you can get even lower level weapons or even just a low damage um really high fire rate weapon or something like that it'll be good because you can always let them regen also you're going to want to let them um, get to some area that enemies on spawn as you'll see in the video i actually was in the middle of a camp so i think like 15 minutes every 15 minutes enemies will spawn um it just ran back there and i was still testing this um to see what actually made them pop out of the ground which is just critting but just follow them around and they will usually leave the camp at some point and then just do then just do this glitch somewhere else out of a spawn area and you can just do this for an unlimited, unlimited amount of time and they won't come out unless you crit them like i was i've done it a few times for quite a long time and they never pop out of the ground um unless you crit them so you're pretty much free to do this as much as you want if you need ammo i'm not exactly certain if fast traveling will work so even if you don't have a low level infinity i would recommend just getting an infinity um because infinities do they actually don't do a ton of damage so if you can get an infinity with no um element on it that could actually be really good for this even if it's a higher level also i would change up your spec especially for amara like make sure you don't have any gun damage increases um if you don't have a level one infinity like if you're using a level 50 weapon make sure you don't have a bunch of gun damage increases just go tanky um so you're not getting any extra damage that you don't need on the loot tank that's pretty much the entire thing 
So subscribe if you want to see more Borderlands 3 content. Leave a like if you liked the video. Leave a comment down below what you think about this farm. Um, leave in the comments if you have any questions about anything to do with this farm. And thanks for watching.